It's the final few seconds before the lights go out and the race to the podium begins. You know this battle will be won off the track as well as on it. You've studied your tactics, anticipated every move like a grand master. You've researched and analyzed, modified and fine-tuned to perfection. You have honed your instincts to give you an edge over your rivals. Your drivers focused, your team ready. The championship in the balance. First past the checkered flag, the goal. Epic victory or ultimate failure. Welcome back F1 Manager family to another F1 Manager video. Today's video we're going to be continuing our how to. Uh, so I think the last one we, we the last one we did was on Hungary. So today we're going to continue the how to and we're going to be going on France. All right, so we're going to be trying to match on France uh, for the how to. So we're on the main account. So once again, uh, the main account strategy is not for new players and it's not for uh, players with low levels. So you'll have to watch the entire video when I will be switching over to my junior account. And that's part of the video would be for new players and for players with drivers at low levels. All right. So for the uh, main account here, we're going to be using the fast pit time tune. Let's get straight into this. Remember to subscribe to the channel, turn on your post notifications. Also hit the like button. Remember we have a giveaway going on currently. Uh, we will be giving away a Game & King t-shirt. Uh, so make sure to check out that video uh, to enter. To see how you can enter into the giveaway. Also we have a 20% discount going on right now over at the merch store for a Game & King merch. Uh, code word THANKS uh, for a 20% discount. So you can go and copy your merch at the checkout typing code word THANKS and you'll get a 20% discount. Alright, so let's get straight into this video. All right, so we're going to be looking for France. Let's hope we get France right off the bat. Let's see. Let's see if we get this match now. Fingers crossed. All right, finally. Finally, this is about take six. Finally, we get matched on France. All right, so let's get straight into this. So uh, the best technique for high-level drivers high level players on France uh, would be the four uh, three 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 two two what am I saying the three three two would be the best technique on all soft tires uh, you could use uh, the three uh, three hard tires in the middle but uh, three soft two conserve boost one conserve two boost one uh, would be the best technique to use. Let's see here what we can do. So you want to boost and then you want to cut down there. Let's cut down with Albana as well. The rival Kimi has pulled away. All right. So we're going to conserve for two laps and boost the third lap into pit and then conserve uh, for two laps and boost back the six into pit into pit and then boost the finish all right so there you can see 65 percent across the finish line 65 percent across the finish line so we're good for three laps here arrival hamilton should go to pit in this uh, second lap he's running Hamilton and Grosjean <coughs> pardon me alright let's boost here by pit come back down Boost, give support, cut back down, putting those gold pit orders into soft tires. Mm -hmm. 
Let's boost in Kimmy from here. Cut down. Reboost back into pit. Alban got stuck exiting the pits. That's not good for us. It's alright. Let's go down. Go down. Alright, so as a main account, you can also use the uh, 332 where you go uh, with three laps uh, on conserve on soft tires. Uh, then you go three laps on boost on hard tires and come back to pit for the last two laps we suffered a breakdown with Albon so you can use that technique as well that technique is what the lower accounts uh, will use so you can use that technique as well and for the one stop you then you go for four and four if you want to use the one stop Alright, let's boost now from here with Kimmy. So we catch up to those who are gonna go to pit. Let's boost there with Albon. They're gonna go to pit now, so we're gonna boost by and then cut back down. So we can make it back to pit without running out of tires. Boost by and cut back down. Alright, so this Albon breakdown is gonna hurt. Uh, we just wanna we wanna make it into pit so we can come out right behind our rivals Grosjean and not be in there for too much of the traffic. So we wanna come out right behind our rival Grosjean here. Let's boost Kimi in. Let's boost Albon in. Alright, so as long as we come out right behind our rival Grosjean, we should be good with Albon. Alright, so our rival is coming to pit. Uh, so that's good news for us. Now we can just go and create some distance. Hamilton should go back to pit as well. So we just need to create some uh, for Kimi to catch up to that Hamilton. Get some overtaking done here. Kimi, DRS zone. No overtaking being done. He's not even trying to overtake at all Hamilton going back to pit there Kimi now will get up in front there he goes hard tires this is definitely a bot that we're racing but the technique still stands so if it was a bot or a real player doesn't matter uh, the technique is what we're using that's what stands So this is a 332 on soft tires. France is a bit of a long track. Uh, so that's why uh, you have to conserve for most of it. If, you, if you're going to be using the hard tires in the middle, uh, that will make it a lot easier for your drivers. Uh, because you won't need to conserve for too much. All right. So that's the technique, 332 on soft tires for eight lap races on high level drivers. All right, so this is moving away from the soft, the hard tires and that will give you a faster race. All soft tires will give you a faster race than a race with hard tires in the mix. All right, all right. Uh, so let me switch over now to the new account where I'm gonna be doing uh, the strategy for new guys and low level drivers uh this that strategy is recommended for for drivers at at least uh level six and up level six level seven epics uh not epics rares level six and level seven rares and level uh seven eight nine uh level eight nine and ten uh commons uh so yeah let's switch over to the next account i'll be right back 
all right guys so we're back on our junior account or brand new junior account this is our brand new let's play account uh, we recently unlock series 8 uh, in a farming uh, while we were farming over there on switch in our live streams so we're at series 8 and look what I just saw it's the first time coming on this account all day and I have just saw that Lewis Hamilton is in the shop so we're gonna be buying a few Hamilton cards here with our 250 bucks now we're gonna buy as much as we can get and so that's gonna give us five cards so 250 bucks give you five Hamilton cards let's go level him up to level two so we only need now nine cards uh, to get him to level three nice all right so let's put Kimi on let's put Grosjean on let's compare Hamilton to Grosjean Wow, so level 2 Hamilton seems to be a lot better uh, than our current level Grosjean, which is level 6. However, we're going to be using uh, level 6 Grosjean uh, for this video uh, because of his tire management. We're going to use him over Lewis Hamilton. Alright. Alright, so let's try and see uh, if we can get matches again. We're rocking with the fast pit time tune. Uh, this is my version of the fast pit time tune on the junior account. Alright, so you should get your version of the fast pit time tune. Just focus on getting your pit time down and you should be good. So let's get straight into this race. Hopefully we get a, a early match on France here and not have to search like seven times like previously. So this race is for new players. Let's let me wait for the match. All right, so that was take two, and we got matched on France. Uh, so yeah, let's get straight into this. So as I was saying, this strategy is for new players and players with low level drivers. All right, so if your drivers are level five and below, your rares are level five and below, your epics are level seven and below, then this is a technique that you wanna use once you're racing on France. All right, so as you can see, Kimi saying two to two, so we can get three laps from that Kimi. However, if your driver is saying one to two, you don't want to use soft tire to start. You want to do the four to two strategy uh, where you select hard tires, go for four laps and conserve, come back into soft tires and boost to the finish from there. Uh, repeat again into soft tires. All right, so we're going to go with the new technique here uh, for our drivers, as you see, two to two and two to three on Grosjean. So you want to start off with the boost. And because Kimi says two to two, you, as you start off with the boost, you want to cut him down right away from boosting. And we can cut Grosjean down a little later uh, because he has a lot more tire management. He can go the distance. But Kimi two to two, you have to cut him down really early and let him start his conserve phase a lot earlier than how you would start your conserve phase with Grosjean. So right away, because the game realized uh, what we're doing here, uh, they gave us a breakdown on Kimi because the game realized that uh, this Kimi is going to go for three laps and he's going to outrun or rival Verstappen there really easy. And we're going to outrun or rival Kevin Magnuson, so they gave us a breakdown, but that's all right. Uh, we're still going to get the win either way. All right. So let's just let our drivers continue to conserve. Kimi passed the line with his 65%. Grosjean crossed in the line with his 55% as well. So they're good for three laps. While our rival drivers will be going to pit uh, in this lap. With both drivers as a matter of fact. Alright. So let's keep a close eye on Kimi here. So he maintains his position. Grosjean lost out of position to Kevin Magnussen. And Kevin Magnussen starts to pull away. But that's alright. Grosjean is just right behind and we will be getting by as they go into pit. It would be nice to boost by pit, uh, but you can't uh, because your driver's levels are really low. You don't want to damage your tire management and make your drivers not make it back around to pit uh, with tires on. All right. So you have to be disciplined and conserve for three laps. All right, we're going to go back into hard tires, wrong tire selection there. Uh, we're going to go back into hard tires, and those hard tires are what we're going to use now to boost 
for three laps so it's still the 332 technique but this is a 322 with hard tires in the middle let's boost our Kimi into pit there and let Grosjean come by the time Kimi gets out Grosjean should be in serving that breakdown there we go right just perfect timing there serving his breakdown and he's out of there all right so now we're going to be in our boost phase but we're going to be boosting for three laps all right and due to how we suffer that breakdown our rival, our rival is in front with his verstappen however he he will have to go back to pit with both of his drivers so we'll get the overtake while he's in pit and then we're going to set up ourselves uh, for the undercut in which we're going to go go back to pit in the sixth lap while if he selects the next pair of hard tire a uh, soft tires he's going to go back to pit again in the six as well all right so there goes the undercut and there we go let's see if he goes soft tires all right so he goes soft tires once more there goes Grosjean again with the undercut he goes soft tires once more so he'll have to go back to pit in the six while we're going to be going back to pit as well in the six however he won't be boosting but we will be boosting all right so this is why this technique is this technique is the key for new players if you're in the lower series series 2 uh, then you can use this technique from series 2 series 3 is a wet race so it's a whole different uh, play but you can still use this exact technique with wet tires as well conserve for three laps boost for three laps go back to pit and boost to the finish all right as well with wet tires it works wonderful as well uh, four wet tires so we're gonna go back now to soft tires here all right as you can see our rival Magnussen is way in the back getting stuck on those hard tires and our, our rival Verstappen also is gonna go to pit in this lap as well and we're gonna boost now for two laps and that should be it this race is definitely in the bag from here and yeah that's the strategy you want to be using you can use this technique in series 4, series 5, series 6, series 7 is a different ball game, series 8, series 9, series 10, series 11, series 12. This technique can be used for all of those 8 lap races. Alright. So if you haven't already tried this technique, make sure you use it. And remember, if your drivers are saying 1-2 to two on soft tires, you want to switch to the 4-2-2. Four, the four two two and go with hard tires for four laps come back to pit in the in the fourth lap into soft tires boost for two laps come back to pit in the sixth lap uh and come back to a fresh pair of soft tires and boost to the finish all right all right so this technique is insane for new players and for low level drivers all right so we managed to get in front of both our rival drivers and yeah pulling away great technique to also use in the GP events uh, to score points good technique it's definitely an awesome technique to use all right so we're out of fuel on the last lap uh, we always run out of fuel on the last lap with this technique but that's okay as you can see we're way in the lead here there's no way no one is getting back up catching us so that's a good race well done good luck so now I'm now next for the next technique we're gonna go for uh, the one-stop strategy on France as these are the best techniques to use on these series on these tracks though you wouldn't use the one stop strategy in the GP but for a new player that is just coming in uh, the one stop would be nice uh, for you to use uh, because your drivers will not be overtaken as much so yeah the one stop will definitely be good alright so let's go back down to France let's go get that match All right, so we got France. Nice. So take two, and we are at France. Then we're gonna go for the one stop. 
so if you're a new new player you're just starting out uh, into the game the one stop is going to be a very critical strategy for you to use uh, to get your first set of wins and to level up your first uh, your drivers a little bit in the start all right so as you can see Grosjean here and Kimi is saying three to four laps your driver at start will say three to four laps not like Grosjean who has good tire management saying three to five your drivers are going to say three to four all right so what you want to do is you want to go for four laps and conserve and then you want to go back to four laps and then you want to conserve for the remainder of four laps all right if you're going to go with a one stop it's not ideal uh, because it's a slower race uh, but it it gets the job done all right but the best way to go is to go for uh, four laps and come back into soft tires uh, for new new players just starting out the game best ways to go is to go for four laps and conserve come back into soft tires boost for two laps come back into soft tires and boost to the finish but we're going to showcase the one stop uh, just in case you want to use the one stop here now uh, we're going to showcase that all right so we're conserving for four laps our rival is also using hard tires and he's going to conserve for i guess the same four laps using perez and kevin magnuson grosjean is in the back slacking off Kimi in the front here losing positions left right and center uh, because he's in hard tires so when when conserving in hard tires your drivers are going to be slowed a bit so you'll have to keep an eye give them a little boost every now and then all right so they can keep up uh, with their positions and just cut back down let them go conserve for those four laps all right There we go. So you're you're gonna be your aim is gonna be gaining positions uh, from the pits. So you want to overtake those that are in the pits. That's what you want to aim for uh, as a new player coming into the game. Unless your drivers are, if your drivers are doing pretty good and they're overtaking and getting the job done, then the 422 will be the best technique for you. Uh, but if not, then the 44 is the best technique for you to use. All right. And remember, if your drivers are saying one to two on soft tires, then they're going to be saying two to four on hard tires. All right. And you want to use those hard tires. Get that start in. Let's boost uh, Grosjean here so we can get by some of these cars that are in the pits. All right, let's cut him back down. Let's cut down uh, Kimi. Let's go back. To hard tires let's boost off Kimi here uh, let's cut back down with Kimi let's boost him here so he get that position from that Perez that's out of tires let's boost uh, Grosjean here so he can catch up to Perez before Perez goes into pit uh, with no tires on oh forgot to go to pit with Grosjean go to pit all right, so we caught we caught up to Perez before he goes into pit. And we're gonna go into pit just behind. So once you go into pit uh, and those hard tires and you're back out, you want to go to regular driving. You don't want to boost uh, because you want to get four laps on these hard tires. And once you go to regular driving, your drivers will get that four laps. You can also conserve some of the laps, some portion of the laps. Now once you see you're not getting attack. So you can go to regular driving if you see that a car is pulling up close, looking like they want to overtake. So you can just play with regular driving into conserve, into regular driving, into conserve, uh, into regular driving, into conserve. So you get the maximum amount of laps. So let's cut down there since there is nobody there. Let's boost here with Grosjean so we can get those positions that are in pit. All right, let's cut him back down there. All right, we're going to keep that conserve going. Keep that conserve going. We're saving tires and we're saving fuel. However, we don't need to save fuel. We need to save tires uh, so we can get four laps. 
so go up to regular driving but for you for for a player that's just coming into the game uh, you don't want to be using regular driving too much it's going to burn your tires down so you want to make sure that you're using the conserve button a lot all right let's boost Grosjean now so as you can see Grosjean passing the line at 54 percent so he's good for two laps and that's what we need remaining so we're in conserve now with Kimi we're ahead of our rival so we can manage to conserve uh, for the remainder of the race and we can manage to use regular driving uh, we're losing some positions that's all right our rival is way way behind or Kimi here and everything is looking pretty decent so you can serve just play around with your conserve and your regular driving uh, so your drivers can maintain their positions and gain a few positions as well as long as you're in front of the rival uh, that's key and if you follow this strategy and go for four laps and conserve you will be in front of the rival all right so now we're gonna get ready to boost now into pit into the finish uh, let's boost there with Kimi and let's line up Grosjean now to boost him here as our rival Perez is about to run out of tires again well done good luck Kimi going in for the finish and that's the one stop uh, with hard tires on France all right let's see if Grosjean can get around or rivals Perez all right so he didn't manage to get around Perez on zero tires that's okay the win is in the bag well done good luck bro all right so that's the, the that's the one stop strategy that you want to be using on France if you're just coming into the game you want to use the one stop if your drivers are saying one to two you want to use the 4 4 the 4 2 2 with hard tires and if your drivers are saying 2 to 2 or 2 to 3 then you want to use that 3 laps on conserve on soft 3 laps on boost all right and if you're a high level player then you want to use that 3 3 2 all soft tires all right hope for this video helps and I'll see you guys in the next one Peace.